Ryan Bossangs, it's Bryson. And Ryan, here is your first K. CTC broadcast. I can't believe it's our first broadcast for our very own studio here at Miller. Dreams do come true. If you wake up and go to work. Speaking of work, there are a number of people working behind the scenes to make this all happen. Take a look how it all came together. Yeah, teamwork makes the dream work. All the time. Hey Bryson, I got a question for you. What's that? What do you call a bagel that can fly? I don't know. What? A plain bagel. <laughs> I got another question. Okay, what? What do you call an M&M &M that went to college? Hmm, I don't know about that one. A smarty! <laughs> yeah. Hey, I got another joke. Hold up, Brian. I got another question for you. What's that? It's our very own question of the week. Cool! I'm my best friend and we have got some things to do. Hey Mustangs, it's Nicholas. Hey man, here with the Question of the week. They were asking, what's your favorite child in the week? That's a great question. Let's get started. So Lexi, what's your favorite child in the week? My favorite childhood memory, I was about 10 years old, and that memory is when my mom oh, took me to Disneyland after school. That's amazing. Thank you for bringing my interview. No problem. So, JJ, what's your favorite childhood memory? My favorite childhood memory is learning how to draw as a kid, learning how to draw characters for my future goals. Future goals. My my future goal is to to create a show to entertain people. That's a cool goal. Thanks for sharing. No problem. So what's your favorite child in the morning? What's your favorite? What's your favorite job? thing to do? Stay home. Stay at home. And what else? Play. I'm a play. I play. With my friends. Thank you for sharing with me. That was a great answer. Thank you. Thank you. My favorite childhood memory has to do with music. My dad used to play the radio, and now when I hear songs that were played on this radio station back then, it reminds me of him. <laughs> you came back and visited us. Thank you. You're welcome. You know, this is my favorite place. My favorite childhood memory, I would say it is when we would go on cross-country trips with our whole family and we would go in our camper and we would drive 3,000 miles from California all the way to Pennsylvania. How old were you? Very first trip when I was three years old and we would go every four years. Oh wow, like it's like a tradition. It was a tradition. That's yes. okay. Thank you for doing this interview with me. You're very welcome. Thank you, Myrna. Thank you. 
That wraps up the question of the week. We hope you enjoyed it. Now back to our host. Everyone had great answers. What do you think, Bryson? Bryson? Oh, sorry. Where am I? Yeah, that was a great segment. What were you thinking about? I was thinking about one of my favorite childhood memories. My mom used to take me to my sporting events all the time. Well, you know, this Sunday just happens to be Mother's Day. Yeah, shout out to the moms. Love you, mom. What are you planning for the big day? I don't know, chocolate, flowers, cards, or just have fun. How about watching a baseball game for all times? Hmm. Well, maybe not on Mother's Day unless you're a baseball fan. If you really want to get into the sports, just so happens, Miller has a team for you. Yeah, that's right. Take a look at all the great sports here at Miller. That was inspiring. How do you get to join a team, Bryson? As easy as one, two, three. Step one, listen to announcements when it's time to sign up. Step two, come on on the field and join in on fun. What's step three? Repeat step one and step two. Easy peasy. Hey Bryson, I have another great joke just in time for Mother's Day. Remember, we want our mothers to be happy on their day. No, trust me, here it goes. It matters as your son. I'm warning you, if you fall out of that tree and break both of your legs, don't come running back to me. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a break, please. I will. How about a little late, late breaking, breaking news? news? Break it out. My stakes is Mallory and Kelsey here with your late, late breaking, breaking news. news. We have the latest information to make the end of the year great. We don't want you to miss any of the action, so listen up. Get your dancing shoes because we have one more dance coming your way. It's going to be on Friday, May 19th from 6 to 8 at night. Ooh, that's nice. There will also be a parent meeting here at the same time here at school. Next, we have one more all school event. Woohoo! This time, it's basketball. I can't wait until June 2nd. Three points! I cannot wait for June 12th and the last day of school. Summertime, and we get out early. Hey, June 12th, also graduation day. It starts at 9.30 in the Cleveland gym. Last but not least, there's still time to sign up for ESY. It starts on June 26th. And it ends on July 25th. Be sure to sign up to hold your spot. Well, most things that wraps up for late breaking news. And now, back, back to your host. I can't believe it. The year is almost over. It's summertime, everyone. I can't believe the seniors are almost done at Miller. They are going to be missed. Hopefully, they come back next year and visit. We wish them all the best. Take a look at this goodbye to the seniors of Miller CTC. Thanks for the memories.
Aw, oh, man, I really hate to see him go. Me too, but we can't stay here forever. No, change is a part of life. You know another part of life, Bryson? No, what, Ryan? Birthdays! Now that's a reason to celebrate. In fact, it's time to do a... Birthday, birthday shout out! out. Hey, my stinks, it's Abenino. And Maggie here with the birthday shout out. You got it. Let's start celebrating. Happy birthday to Travis from your friend Brian. Happy birthday to Vicente from Mallory. Happy birthday to Kevin from Bryson. Happy birthday to Lydia from your friend Kelsey. Happy birthday, Michael, from your friend Nicholas. Happy early birthday to Juliana from Myrna. And a very special happy birthday to Megan from all of us. Thank you guys, that's sweet. Hmm, we couldn't name everyone. So happy birthday to anyone celebrating. And now, back to your host. There is so much to celebrate. Did you know that three members of the Miller staff are retiring this year? Yes, I heard that. We want to wish Missy, Doug, and Miss Eileen as the very best retirement as we begin their new chapter. You're retired. Goodbye, tension. Hello, pension. Wow, it's the end of the year. Oh, the summer is great. That reminds me of a joke. A man walks into a bar. Hold on for that note. We want to thank everyone for their support for our first broadcast. Thanks to my co-host, Ryan. And my co-host, Bryson. And always remember, be true to you. Thanks for watching. KCTC, signing off. off.